So anyway, this was actually going to be my intro to the video. Me talking about how important it is, letting down your tyres before you hit the beach. Me not knowing how to use this tyre deflator. That was interesting. Luckily the father-in-law was there with uh, his trusty old unit. But anyway, as you can see, we forgot to turn the mic on. So, happy days. Here we are. We're hitting the Burham Coast National Park. We're hitting the uh, Kinkuna camping zone section and we're going to go and check it out. I've heard it's a wicked spot um, for going camping and stuff like that. So we're going to do a bit of a recce down here, do a bit of fishing, do a bit of full driving and of course just do a bit of kicking back and relaxing. So hope you enjoy. After kicking back for a few hours and having some lunch, kids having a swim, building some sand castles and just uh, kicking back, we decided to head down to Theodolite Creek. I can tell you now though, after hitting this beach, checking your tide times and knowing when the best time is to hit the beach would be ideal, especially if you are towing a van or a camp or anything like that. This sand was crazy soft. One thing to keep in mind with the tides is there is a washout that's uh, just north of Theodolite Creek. So we were aware of that, we knew the tides, we got down to Theodolite Creek as quick as we possibly could, uh, checked it out, spent a little bit of time there, but then we did make a move pretty quickly. As you could see the Jeep had no snorkel, so uh, definitely had to keep that in mind. When we went through it wasn't uh, too crazy deep, but we fished there and You'd see that water coming in pretty quick and that did get a lot deeper uh, quite quickly. What happened there, Bill?
Nice. How'd you go? I went. <laughs> yeah. I don't think it's made for four wheel driving our car. Yeah. Is that seat belt on? Awesome.